Hmm. I wonder if my parents are here. I should have gave them a heads up before I came. Oh well. kitchen come over here hmm that's odd hi mom oh hi honey well um I have some news for you oh yay what kind of news do I have now some bad news good news whatever it is it, I don't care oh um okay well, we just decided to get rid of the bunk bed and put your bed, the smaller one, where your bunk bed used to be. So, yeah. <laughs> and the reason why we did that was because we noticed that you were sleeping on that smaller bed a lot more. So, we just thought we can save more money if we got rid of one of the beds. So, please don't be mad. Wait, what? You got rid of my bunk bed? I guess that's okay. I've been wanting to make some space in my room. Even thought it's really big. Whatever, I guess that's fine. Okay, good. I didn't know how you were gonna react to that. Um, also, someone stopped by the door earlier when we got here. I think it may have been one of your friends, but I'm not too sure. What did they look like? It was a boy, a uh, blue husky. Um, he had a red hat on. I'm not too sure if that rings a bell. Hmm, he sounds familiar. Oh, Jacob. Wait, what was he doing here? What did he say? Oh, so that's his name. Oh, okay. Well, that's good to know. But uh, anyways, he asked if you were home and I told him no. And then he gave me an envelope and told me that it was for you and I think he wanted to talk to you because I can kind of tell that he wanted to stick around and wait but um we were kind of in a rush but uh, I'm sure he'll call you later on so let me go get that envelope right now Jacob Kings wanted to talk to me what no that that can't be true here you go, honey. Oh, thanks, Mom. Cool. So, um, are you gonna read it here? What? Oh, um, no, I'll just read it later. I'm kind of busy right now. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna get your dad and we're gonna head to the grocery store now, so I'll be seeing you later, okay? Yeah, sure thing, Mom. I'm gonna go to my room now, okay? All right. Well, I'll see you later. Yee! Can't wait to open it. Okay, I need to get to my room now and I need to tell Ari and Lucy. They're gonna be so excited. Hey guys. I can't wait to open this note and find out what it's about and call Jacob and see what he wanted to talk about. And I can't wait to tell Ari and Lucy what happened. It's gonna be so awesome. Yes. Yeah. But when am I gonna read it? Just read it on my bed. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, it's just an invitation to his birthday party. Oh my gosh, he invited me to his birthday party. He thinks I'm so cool. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, yes. I'm so excited. I have to pick an outfit that is perfect for this so that I will be the one that stands out the most. Well, this is nothing close to a love note telling me that he loves me, but whatever. I'm gonna go to his birthday party, yes! <laughs> okay, I have to tell Ari. I have to, I have to. Okay. Hello? Oh, hi Ari! Guess what? Guess what? What? What happened? Tell me, what, what happened? Did Emma do something to you? What? No, I would never let that mutt do anything to me. But 
guess what? Oh my gosh, I have to. Jacob invited me to his birthday party. Isn't that awesome? Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Sadly, he didn't invite me. Bing! Oh wait, he just did. Yay! Oh my gosh, we both get to go to his birthday party. Wait, what about Lucy? Is she coming? I hope so, but that's so cool. Wait, I have something that I need to tell you. What was it? I have something to tell you. We need to go shopping. Oh my gosh, I need a whole new outfit. You know what, I just realized something. What's that? My parents don't have money to afford stuff like this. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna be stuck with the same old clothes that I have. I'm sure he's seen me wear these clothes like a hundred times at school. to the mall and you're gonna be there tomorrow at 12 p.m. like we did today and we're gonna go shopping and I'm gonna pay for the clothes how about that what no Ari you no know, I, I can't do that that's not okay I'm using your money and I don't want to do that nope I'm not taking no for an answer but I do have something to tell you but uh, what Emma's planning to sabotage your fur and everything. I overheard her and I ran over there and I told her that that wasn't the best idea and she just laughed at me. And so now they're planning to sabotage everything that you have, like your clothes and, and your fur. I get, she doesn't even care if you get hurt. So we need to Think fast and try to prevent this from happening. No, no, we can tell Jacob, right? But me and Jacob aren't really friends. He just invited me. I just saw this as an opportunity to actually be friends. I can't just go up to him and be like, oh my gosh, Emma's gonna so totally ruin my fur. Mm. Can't just do that. I don't think he even knows me. Mm, you're right. You know what? You know who is friends with us and him? Lucy. What is Lucy gonna do? She's on vacation and probably not gonna be seeing her for like a week or something. I haven't even gotten news that she's back. So how am I gonna get help from her? I don't know, but you could probably call her to call Jacob and tell him the whole plan that Emma has. I don't know, something like that. 